What is up, internet? It's Captain's Log 169, T minus four days until the trade deadline, also known as Armageddon. Morale is still high, voice still very low. I'm here in Kansas City, just came from Toronto, and the customs officers told me that my voice was way too offensive to allow back into the country. So they're gonna hold on to it for a couple days, slowly release it back to me as I learned my lessons, not to be so offensive. In all seriousness, had a lot of people asking me about my thoughts on the trade deadline and kind of what it's like to be in my situation, being talked about, being traded um, to multiple different cities, and every day there's new rumors and all sorts of, I guess, interesting takes on my character, and some people really want me and some people really don't, and I'm a bad teammate or I'm not a bad teammate or I'm a good pitcher and my antics don't matter or whatever the case is. So I figured I'd just kind of walk you guys through what it's like kind of waking up every morning and reading all that stuff or tuning into the game and seeing me be talked about in trade rumors, going to LA, San Diego, Philadelphia, Atlanta, New York, Houston. Like every day it's kind of a new rumor. Someone new heard something new from someone new and said something new and it's all very interesting. I don't really know exactly what to feel about it. It's kind of going to be my career as a whole. I intend to sign one year deals. so. And pretty much every year I'm going to be in conversations about being traded. It really doesn't affect me, though, like going to the field, my mindset, like whatever team I'm on, I go to the field and do my job anyway. I prepare the same way um, and do the same things, try to get myself ready for uh, competition and to be the best that I can be. That being said, I'd, I'd love to stay uh, with the Indians. I think we have a really good group of guys. <laughs> I was just last night I was watching uh, Kevin Plawecki's cookie review. Every hotel we stay in, he orders milk and cookies and sends out a cookie review. Uh, they're quite hilarious. <laughs> and uh, last night's was a, was a real treat. Enjoyed that part of it. Uh, we just got a lot of really good chemistry here on this, on this year's team. Uh, everyone enjoys being around each other, hanging out at the ballpark. A lot of guys, kind of younger leaders in the clubhouse that have established a little bit of a new culture and really propelled us forward. And I think that's one of the reasons we've been on such a roll recently. So it's been a lot of fun being around, been a lot of fun being involved with that. Love to see what this group can accomplish and and do moving forward. I'm everyone in the clubhouse is very confident in our abilities and you know we show up to spring training every year trying to win a world championship and we all think that we can do that. So it'd be kind of a shame to to be traded away from that. Um, obviously that's kinda of out of my control. But it's just been it's been a very interesting process. The first time I've really been involved in trade talks um, at the deadline. So I'm kind of enjoying it. A lot of good exposure in a lot of, a lot of other markets, um, lots of other fan bases kind of finding out who I am, which is good for the brand. But it's, uh, it's, been, it's been fun, it's been an interesting time. I'm looking forward to having it be over and kind of knowing what the situation's gonna be and getting ready for October. Are you gonna be relieved that uh, the 31st rolls around? Just kind of know, like you don't have to be, run through that, that <clears throat> ringer until the end of the season again? Uh, let's see, will I be relieved when the 31st comes around? Probably not relieved. Uh, I think relieved is kind of indicates that there's been some sort of anxiety or, or whatnot. I haven't really been anxious about it at all. It's just been enjoyable. I've been kind of just hanging out, enjoying the rumors and laughing about the things that are, <laughs> that are said. All the hot takes are so funny, you know? Bauer can't get traded to Houston because he wouldn't get along with Bregman. Or we don't want Bauer in New York because he couldn't handle the media. Please, you know, come to come to San Diego. We have great tacos. You'd love the tacos. Like <laughs> all of these things, all these sales pitches from the different fan bases are very interesting, very funny. I, I've enjoyed reading all of those. No, yeah, I don't think I'll be relieved. It'll just be kind of a, another day and I'll just show up to the field, whatever field I'm at, and go about doing my thing, measuring my blood, taking all my daily measurements, trying to be the best picture I can be, collecting all my data, logging all my stuff in the spreadsheets, spending an hour or two a day tracking my daily metrics. Hopefully I'll have my voice back by then too. That'd be nice. I haven't really been able to talk crap to my teammates the last couple of days because I haven't had a voice. So that's been the biggest thing I've missed, being able to talk crap to my teammates.